everyone, this is Priscilla from Like Priscilla. This is my first video in English and I don't know if it's going to be the last. It depends on the comments and the views of this video. And well, I am kind of um, anxious about the answer of this video. I, I know there are a lot of viewers in English in spoken that are on my channel that they see me and well this is a test just to see if you would like to see more videos in English or in Spanish I think that uh, a lot of videos here in, on YouTube it doesn't matter the language to use they are very specific and and as it is a tutorial it's it shows a lot the products that we use and the form that we put the makeup but I would like to to hear your comments and to see if I can have more subscribers from you so well this is the look I have today this is like a cranberry makeup I would use this definitely at night it has a lot of highlights here on the lid and very dramatic eyelashes so well this is how it finish so if you would like to see how I do this makeup please keep wash first I'm going to prime my lid and I'm using Urban Decay eyeshadow primer potion and I'm putting on my lid then I'm going to use this lip lipstick in wine color and I'm going to put it on my lid this is going to work like a base color and don't worry it's going to fade without any eyeshadow this is a blending brush I don't know the number but whatever blending brush you have we're going to blend and to try to erase all the line it doesn't matter if you pass this line you can always clean at the end then I'm going to use this eyeshadow this is from Urban Decay it's called Hit I purchased this eyeshadow a long time ago I don't know if they sell in Sephora and I'm going to put here my lid just to set the lipstick I had put in my lid this is a cranberry color, this is from MAC and I am going to put at the end of my lid on the crease area and I am going to put and pack all the color at the end of my lid then I am going to use this color, this is from MAC also, I don't know the name but this is going to help to to help to do the transition color for my crease I think in Anastasia Beverly Hills they have a, a similar eyeshadow called Soda something soda, I don't have that eyeshadow but this in, in MAC you can find it here in Mexico it's more, more common to, to find MAC Anastasia we only find on the States so that's why I prefer to use something that is, is more easy for me to find here and they have very similar colors then I'm going to use this handwritten color this is from MAC it's like a um, um, rich brown and I'm going to put at the end of my lip okay. then I have to I, I, I need to change off brush and I'm going to blend this color and then it's time to clean with this or makeup remover <laughs> very careful we're going to make like an angle here and then we're going to clean the other side you can also clean all the excess of eyeshadow that can fall 
and you're ready to do the next step. Then I'm going to use this color just to highlight the upper lid. I'm gonna use this pigment, this is from True Colors, it doesn't have a name of the color but it's like um, um, beige, rosy beige, it's very pigment and I'm going to wet my brush then I'm going to blend the colors And then I'm going to use this cranberry color on the under lid. I'm going to reapply this golden color. And then I'm going to use again the handwritten only at the end of my lid. I'm going to do that rest of my face and then I'm going to come back with uh, to finish all my eye. I'm going to use my Makeup Forever. With these movements, we are going to apply in every part of our face. And this kind of foundation is made to put it like this way, not to rub. So the color and the coverage would be just fine for us. I'm going to apply this stroke of light. This is of Burp Minerals. And be sure to blend like this because if you rub, you're going to take out the product of your face. I like to use this Maybelline H Rewind this is a little bit lighter, just to highlight this area. Well, while I was charging my um, battery, I put, I set my foundation with this Hello Flawless. It's from Benefit and I put it in all my face. Then I used to set the under concealer. I like to use this one, it's on white, but you can use also Laura Mercier. I also use that one in another makeup tutorials. And also I contour my face with the contour kit of Anastasia Beverly Hills with this shade that I like because it's very natural. And I put bronzer because I feel a little bit white fade. And I used this Get Me Sun that I'm sure you know it. It's from MAC. And I put also my eyelashes. These are very pretty. They are from House of Lashes and they are called Feathered. And for blush, I used these two colors. This is a palette without a brand. You can find it on my webpage. I'm going to put all the links below. This is from Still Other. And I'm going to use this highlight. This is from Becca. It's called Moonstone. And I'm going to put it here. Just like a V shape. It's just only to the purpose. It doesn't have to see where it ends and where it finishes. And it's going to end on my highlight. Also my cupid bone the tip of my nose and all the way long up here over my eyebrow and here my tear dot just to highlight and fresh my eye look the difference 
I would like to use this lip gloss. This is from Still Other. You can choose whatever lip gloss that you have that is kind of nude. Or you can use a rust color, a red color, but I think that is too much for this look. And also I'm going to try the true color, this pigment. We can use it also as a lip color. But, well, this is it. I hope you liked this video. So please comment and subscribe if you like this video and if you would like to see more videos in English. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. After five.